All right, so welcome to another edition of Kids Can. Today, we're gonna see if kids can Pinterest. And today I have these cuties with me. I have Megan and Eric, and they're gonna help me to do a Sharpie coaster sort of tie-dye thing. And for our project today, you're gonna need a white tile, Sharpies, rubbing alcohol. Um, I've heard 91% is a good, a good percentage to use. Um, uh, enamel to cover up after you're done and then if you don't want it to scratch up your uh, coffee table you can get I already had these so they're little felt pads to put on the bottom of it so it keeps it from scratching the table all right to start out we are going to um, let them paint um, cut color so when I first sharpies. saw this Pinterest project I thought it was actually on canvas so I thought it might be interesting to try coloring it on canvas too just to see if it would work um, as compared to doing it on the tile. So y'all start coloring it on the tile and I'm gonna open this canvas. Cause anyway, Eric's making an orange. A Rasta orange. A Rasta orange? <laughs> <laughs> this is what came into my mind, a Rasta orange. Does it sing Jamaican music? <laughs> I don't know. I All right, you can work on the canvas. We'll see if the canvas works. Hmm. So, the, the, the instructions on Pinterest sort of made like an abstract pattern and you just need to cover up the whole entire tile with fun colors. And when we get that done, we'll show you what happens next. This is Megan. I think it's just the canvas because it's, I don't know. I just bought them. They can't dry out. Please don't. There's Eric coloring his smiley face. I think it's just. So while they're doing that, um, as I was telling you before, you can take the little felt pieces and I think this is really big enough to use, um, so I'm going to cut them into fours to put on the corners. These kind of three, they're, they're, they fling. You got to chase those puppies down though because they try to run away. Oh, don't say puppy. puppy. Don't say what? Don't say puppy. Don't say puppy. You think he'll come? We have a puppy with us today, so. Yes. Woo! I thought. <laughs> I threw that one in. I threw it at Eric. Now oh. he's looking at me. Oh, all right. So there's two. You think we'll get three done? Warning, this video may include corny jokes. Oh, I have one. Oh, let's hear it, Megan. Uh, how do you get a baby ass not to sleep? How do you get a baby ass not to sleep? <clears throat> I don't know. You sing a lunar by. A lunar by, that's pretty funny. Then there's another answer for it. Also, rocket. Oh. I I can also tell facts. Oh, what kind of do you have an astronaut fact? Yes. A fact for that is that that when she said lunar by, she meant by saying lunar because lunar Luna is the name of our moon. Oh. Luna okay. is also the name of a character in My Little Pony. Oh. I don't think I knew either one of those. I have a silly joke that's not nearly as educational. You remember my silly joke? Yes. What, how do you make uh, tissue donuts? Do you put a little bug in Oh, you know that one. <laughs> yeah, I've heard it a ton of times. But it's so funny every time it's I hear it. It's silly. Okie doke. So we have taken and we have colored with Sharpie until we covered the whole entire tile with um, color. So that's oh, okay. Sorry. That's that Eric. So Megan has got one and I, I went ahead and did one too. And so Megan did, we, we are trying the canvas. We found out with the canvas I made that a orange. she made her off the orange. The canvas is kind of hard to color on. So I don't yeah. know if that's why they didn't choose it or not, but it, it almost made, it was like you were coloring with a dried out marker, even though they're, they worked on the towel. So the next thing we're going to do is we are going to, I'm going to put the alcohol in a little bottle so it's easier to get to. Okay. It's going to be fun. And then the instructions say that you can either use a med, um, medicine dropper or you can use, um, I call these swizzle sticks, but what do y'all call these? I call them tiny straws. Tiny straws. <laughs> tubes. They're coffee stirrers. I think where we are, most people call them coffee stirrers. I don't know where I got swizzle sticks, but it's fun to it's, say. Yeah, swizzle sticks. So swizzle you're going to take the straw and it's kind of like when you like, do, I don't know, as a kid, I used to play in my Coke and I would I trap know, I some of my Coke. Too. It's fun. And so the alcohol is trapped in the straw and you're just going to get it and you're going to drip it on it and it's supposed to make 
some like tie dye shapes. So it's looking brighter. Oh, oh there it goes. I'll change. I'll change the view so y'all can see. But wow. you sort of just strip it all over, and it sort of smears it. So cool. I'll let Megan and Eric try it. So it's pretty cool looking. It does make it all swirly. So we put down, I think a good idea to put something down on the surface area in case that the alcohol runs onto the table because you don't want that. And they did say that you need to um, maybe try to not go over it because then it will, ooh, that's going to be fun. <laughs> all right. So, and um, like we were, we were talking, if it's hot, sharp, or toxic, then you need to have a grown-up help you. And alcohol can make you sick, and that's what toxic means. So make sure that when you use this that you have a grown-up's permission and that they're... So, Eric, did you see what I did? You want to try it? All right, you go ahead and do it. You need... I'm going to see what happens. Ooh, mine has gone crazy. I need parents... You need parental supervision to do this. You <laughs> need parental guidance. I it's think... a movie. Yes. What? It's... I think I went a little overboard. Don't put too much alcohol because... Oh, wow. Oh, uh, yeah. Looks, oh, that actually looks pretty cool. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. It's interesting. <laughs> you can't cool. see the flower anymore. Yes. So... In the instructions, too, they did have sort of a geometric abstract shape. So maybe they realized that the pattern wouldn't last if you had a pattern. Oh, Eric's is doing pretty good. <laughs> you gotta get down to business. Get down to business. <laughs> Not really, Eric. And Boom Man actually made this one. Boom Man did an awesome job. Oh, I can't wait to try it on the Rasta Orange. That'll be fun. Rasta Orange style. I made the Rasta Orange on the canvas. Miss Marcy, do you think that's enough, or? It's just up to you. It is your creation. I'm going to try swishing it. Technically, it's Boom Man's creation. Boom Man! Yeah. He's passed it off. He's passed the torch. Thank you, Boom Man. He's retired. He's retired. He's now a worker. A Boom Man. He's a literally a camera boom. All right, we're going to see what the canvas does, too, when you finish up the Oh, I'm one. excited. Swish it around. I'm done with this one. Okay, Boom Man. Whatever you say, Boom Man, you're awesome. Oh, oh, that looks so oh, cool! Oh my gosh! Hey, one thing: do not touch it when you're when you wipe it. When um, okay. it's still doing it. Cause if you do that, this will happen. <laughs> you end up with permanent. It's working. already happening. Are you done? Oh, you're still working. Still working. Oh, I'm done doing it. <laughs> They're done. Oh, I like that. That's kind of cool looking. I know, right? All right, let's stick it over here to oh, dry. Oh, rust the orange. Rasta time. All right, so now the Rasta moment of truth. The what can do you do on canvas? I think I put it in the wrong it's way. A, it's Experiment 101. <gasps> what is it doing? It's got experiments. Oh, come on, Eric. Not the boss cloud again. The boss cloud He's is He's the scary. mascot. Just kidding. It's not the mascot. It's no. just somebody made up. Yes, he made the boss cloud. It's, weird. it's really cool. Oh, I like it. how Eric's turned out. Is that yours, Miss Marcy? That this one's mine, yeah. Wow, that one looks really cool. How it looks like broken stuff. Awesome. I'm focusing on the Rasta Orange because he is awesome. You, you shine, Rasta Orange. <laughs> it's actually doing it. It's, it's tie dyeing. So the alcohol cool. needs 30 minutes to dry. Okay. So we're going to leave these and let them dry for 30 minutes. And we'll come back and check on them. Welcome back to Kiss Can. And previously on the episode, we did the tie. We did coasters with tie dye. Yeah. And so, in this episode, we're we're going to show you with the what happened with the alcohol, and we're also going to show you with the glaze. Yes. All right. So this after we let the alcohol dry, they sort of made these fun, funky, abstract paintings. The Rastafarian sort of looks like he's crying. Um, I, I think the tiles are better. I think the canvas just was an interesting experiment. Yes, that, it was. Yeah, just, uh, we'll pass on that. 
So the next step is to, like Eric said, is we're going to take a glaze to cover it up so that when, if you put on a, a beverage, that it won't it won't smear the, the, the Sharpie. So he's just going to carefully go over it a couple of times. And this is, you shouldn't do this inside, but it's like 9 Plug degrees it outside. So. Plug it. Oh, 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 oh yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Don't do it super close to it too, or I mean, no, it, it takes off the, it takes off the paint. So we're just gonna a little glaze here and there. Oh. And there. All right, Megan, can I do yours real fast? Can I? Try? I, I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. Here. Well, okay. Here, put it on you this, Megan. Okay. Yeah, I can. All right. Do it. You wanna do it, Jake? You can make a cameo in the oh. video. It's what we do. At the end, there, this, is, this is the other the other sibling, Jake, and it does sort of make fun new extra. Um, oh look, you can like write something on it. Yeah, can I yeah. Try so I wouldn't. It? Um, it said to use a fixant. I don't know what that means, but it evidently does not mean spray. Can I try with the rasta orange? Because it's sort of when you spray it, if you're not super careful. It, it sprays off. You want to spray? Try on Megan's. Be careful. Just barely. Can I do it? Don't do it straight down. Just yeah. I'll do the rust orange. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Don't do it straight down. I'm gonna try the rust orange. All right. So we're gonna leave those. All right. Put the rust orange here. Wait. Uh, we'll you can do whatever you want to the rust orange. Because the rust orange is just. It's already. <laughs> he has issues, so we're gonna. <laughs> So, he has so many emotional issues. All right. Make sure you're not spraying it. it, it there. There you go. All right. <laughs> you got it. Let me try. I want to see what this. Is. Uh, All right. Oh, oh it really doesn't oh, do anything to the rasta. Wow. Guy, though. Oh, it makes it. Yeah, the rasta guy actually looks better. So I, I don't know. The yeah. canvas didn't smear like the towels. So. so um, he's shiny now. Yeah, he's back to he's back to normal. <laughs> We've saved him. But he's so, still crying. He's, still he's crying. crying even more now. So I don't. I'm not sure. Sad. All right. So, so you need to let these dry. But well, I think we can still get the little tabs. So um, I put the I cut up the little fuzzy things that we put them on the bottom of our furniture. So we had these laying extra around, and so I cut up for um, so you could put them on the four corners. So four for Megan, three, four, and four for Eric. I have a question. Um, All right, what's your question? I think well, it's sticky. I, no, you did yours. I thought yours turned out pretty good. Me do oh. some more. I'll do some more. I thought yours turned. You did pretty good with it's yours sticky. on your own. I'll just play it for a second. It may be a little sticky. Whoa. There we go. All right, so touch it by the edges because it, it may not be. But that actually made it look pretty good. Yeah, it looks cool. Yeah, I, it looks I mean, they don't really look bad. Good. All right, so the neat thing about these is they're um, they're like stickers, so they have a self adhesive part, so you can just take it off and stick it on the back. So. Okay. Do we do it right now? Yeah. Go ahead. And you can go ahead. Okay. Like uh, okay, like like that. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. It's fine. All right. So <laughs> we finished up um our our things. We glazed them so that the marker won't run, and we were able to put the little foam adhesive um, strips on the back of it. So now we have our nice coasters. And I think they turned out pretty, pretty cute. Do you think you'll yeah. use these at your house? Probably. Maybe. Probably. I don't know. You use these in your everyday lives. Yeah. You can put them on your coffee table. It's something useful, guys. Yeah. You can put them in your room, on your nightstand. Where else do you think you could put them? Um, at the table. Yeah, on um, the table. On the side table, a coffee table, a on lot your, of tables. On the toilet. Any table. They're table maybe friendly. On, maybe in your bathroom. In your bathroom. Um, I can see that. In the shower. <laughs> <laughs> Why would that be in the oh. shampoo and conditioner, there you go. people? And maybe since these are tiles, you could maybe not put the adhesive on the bottom and just put them on the floor. There you go. You could just tile, retile your floors, but that would be fancy. And you could put this in yeah, your bedroom. Eric made a separate one. It's called the Cloud Boss. The Boss, boss Cloud. cloud. Alrighty. So, can we finish it with kids? Can yeah. But so, don't forget to like. Or share, or and like Eric's been telling us, comments comment in below. in the um comment in the <laughs> comments below to tell us what you think we should do next time. All right, kids can on three. One, two, three. Kids, kids can, can. do everything. <laughs>